And I remember right before I performed, I raised my hands up. And it was kind of the first time I, I felt something else come into me. And I knew that was going to be my coming out night. Oshan, also spelled Osan, is an Orisha de a deity of the Yoruba people of southwestern Nigeria. Oshan is commonly called the River Orisha, or goddess, in the Yoruba religion, and is typically associated with water, purity, fertility, love, and sensuality. She is considered one of the most powerful of all Orishas, and like other gods, she possesses human attributes such as vanity, jealousy, and spite. She is commonly described as, all, as the favorite of all Orishas, by uh, Ola, uh, Ola Dami, which is the god of, of this uh, mythology, African mythology. Those that want children or who may suffer from infertility usually call on Oshan for assistance, this is what Beyonce is pregnant. And she is associated with the concept of femininity and the power of women. More widely, she is sought after in times of drought and severe poverty. The water spirit of Oshan drowns men. His spirit is invoked to emasculate men, put them under the power of women. Women use sensuality and seduction to lure them in and influence him to follow her lead. She manipulates and leads men down paths of worthlessness, shame, blame, and most important, what? Mental illness. This spirit, that's why the man is always just totally emasculate, like Jay-Z, just sitting there, just mind gone. Spirit comes to lead men away from God, just as Eve did in the garden. Her symbolism, the snake, represents the serpent in the garden. The eagle represents the rise of the women in the power. The blood sacrifices are used to appease this goddess. Abortion, issues of blood, fibroids, tumors, cervical diseases, infertility are all living sacrifices of blood to this spirit. She forces women that do not comply with her will by holding their wombs hostage until the woman invokes her until the woman invokes her spirit. She causes promiscuity and sexual folly in women to rob men of their masculine energy. This spirit needs male energy to strive financially and have earthly success that resembles male ego and fortitude. And it also switches between male and female in the twin form abaye, which is what that group I just showed you their name. Y'all still here? Everybody looking at you. This is Beyonce showing the eagle's wings. Of course, uh, Starbucks, that's O'Shine. Uh -huh. And there is Cardi B dressed as O'Shine. And here she is. Uh, this is back when Beyonce was uh, showing her uh, pregnancy during that time. And this is also the sister circle in the river. Worshiping Oshan because she's a river goddess. And here are some other images of her. And the tears that you see on Beyonce's eyes, or Beyonce's eyes, are actually tears that come down because of the pain that Oshan suffers at the hands of men. So men hurt her husband, Oshan's husband, which we'll talk about in a second, has really hurt her in mythology. Beyonce, there's a church. church you see Beyonce is talking about this. Dude, they had pe I didn't I didn't believe it. I, I heard about it, I didn't believe it. There's an actual chapel. I, I think it was like a thousand people. A mm -hmm. thousand people, right? Yeah. They're lined up and they and then they go into the church. And when you go into the church, there's a, a gospel like singers, like you know, gospel. Oh love the world, Jesus. It's Beyonce songs. I am a survivor. I am a They're singing that. In the church clothing, you know, the, the, the robes, wow. they're clapping. And Beyonce has a Sasha Fierce. That's her alter ego, right? That's her demon. Yeah. And she said that, I I remember, because like, oh, you're so amazing on stage. Oh, it's not me. It's not me. Oh, that's, that's Sasha Fierce. You have bowed to the systems of the world. You have bowed. Any of you who are going to Beyonce's concert, I rebuke you in the name of Jesus. How dare you call yourself a Christian? I don't care what pastor you got that is okay with it. I don't care what pastor you got that think is cool. I don't care what pastor you got that's singing along to they song, cause they want some clout. Why 
Why you think that man called himself Jehovah? It was short for Jehovah. When a witch has a coven, it's normally a small thing. Witches' covens are normally three to seven people. When it becomes thousands, it's called a hive. Y'all are part of that lady beehive? And you call yourself a Christian? May the dealings of the Lord come upon you. You think this is small stuff. You think you not going to that lady's concert is not an initiation. You think you not going to that concert is not a ritual. You think you not going to concert is not a gate. That entire concert is a gate. tree by his fruit how can someone thank god dressing him modestly with album covers that look like this with dance routines that look like this with all of these demonic symbols around her how can someone truly believe that beyonce is talking about the god of abraham isaac and jacob bad girl at the naughty church girl don't hurt nobody <laughs> Grace Cathedral in San Francisco, California, hundreds of folks are gonna come here to witness the Beyonce Mass, bringing together secular music and a religious message to tell a story of empowerment for particularly women of color, but for anyone who happens to sing praises to the goddess herself, Beyonce. The Beyonce Mass happens tonight here at Grace Cathedral in San Francisco, and the church is expecting it will be a packed house. She kind of is a god, so like she's pretty amazing. Like her, she's kind of a superhuman, so um, I think that's amazing that she's like taking people to church here, so that's kind of cool. I've been asked time and time again why. Beyonce, I believe that she reminds us that sometimes you have to do your thing your way. You don't do it on demand. You don't do it for your oppressor. You don't sing when they want you to sing. You sing when God tells you to sing. Never give them your song. Beyonce didn't become Beyonce on her own. I'm not standing in front of you because of anything that I've done. As a black woman, I am created in the image of God and I am here to change the game and make the world a better place.